and you know and because, because a lot of a lot of people tend to forget Isaiah they said well because when you had beaten them the previous you beat them 4-1 4-2 4-3 and they finally broke through and they beat you guys uh, and they said that each time that you beat them they shook your hand but I don't know if people rem remember this in 88 when you beat the Celtics they walked off the court and they didn't shake your hand yeah you remember that Isaiah oh yeah I remember that and, and by the way, so, 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 but, but nobody said, hold on, let, nobody said a word about that. It was only became an issue when you guys walked off the court and didn't shake. And I, look, I'm not excusing what you did, but if you didn't have a problem with it three, four years earlier, why you got a problem with it now? Yeah. And, and, and so, yeah, the, when the Celtics walked off, right. Um, Here's the difference. We as the Pistons, we never made a big deal. Right. Celtics walking off, not shaking our hands. They were champions and they deserve to 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 go out how they want to. Yeah. And, 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 and we were thankful and grateful for the lessons that they taught. And now we go on to try to beat somebody else. Right. We never we never sat around and said, oh. You know, Mikhail and, and Mikhail and I are good friends still today. Right. You know, and, 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 and before Dennis Johnson and all them guys, before Dennis Johnson passed and, you know, Larry and I, we see each other today and, and, and it's still cool. But we never, we never said, wow, they didn't shake our hand. What poor sports. And not, we, we never did that. It was like, okay, they were, they were champions. They were exiting and, and, and we moved on. The, the other thing that, that I would say, is the the night before now we're down 3-0 in the series you've heard me speak glowingly about the Celtics and the Lakers as champions mm -hmm. and when we were getting ready to beat them and we knew we had the better team and they were going down we wasn't the day before talking about how they were bad and they were this and they were right bad. they're bad for the nba yes we gave them their respect right now jordan before you know before you know they swept us you know the night before you know he has this big press conference where he he annihilates our team and the one thing that really you know hit us hard is when he called us undeserving champions now you've won Super Bowls. Mm -hmm. You've been a champion. Yeah. Now imagine someone saying that what you earned and what you did, you were undeserving of it. And by the way, it wasn't a coach. It wasn't a media person. It was one of your peers. Right. What made? Why do you think you said that? What made you guys so undeserving? I don't know. <laughs> these, these are questions that 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 you have to ask him right now all i can do is speak for us and speak for the detroit pistons so you know when we when when we walked off and and lambeer said i'm not shaking their hands and this is how we rolled we rolled as a team we rolled as right. a team. you know it's one for all all for one you know, and, and Lambert was like, this is what we're doing. So you fall in line. And that's right. I, I didn't, none of us knew that, and that the camera would be on you. And right. this was supposed to be a passing of the torch. Shannon, that, that is some BS. Ain't never been no <laughs> torch pass and <laughs> glorious moment and all right. that. All that narrative around that was just total made up BS to make one team or one player look bad and another one looked good. That was it. You know what to do. Hit the subscribe button to become an official member of Club Shay Shay, where we always do something before two something.